Welcome back to my channel guys, it's your girl Coco Styles and on this channel we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle and styling guys. So I did a video maybe last week about tailoring and I um, told you guys that I had a blazer from Zara that I got tailored at this amazing tailor in my neighborhood and I wanted to show you guys what she did. <laughs> I'll pop in a video probably over here um what the jacket looked like now as a tall woman blazers are a struggle for us if we're not buying them from a place that caters to tall women um i just did another video you're probably gonna see the same outfit <laughs> and i was like well let me just do this quick one um because i have to run out to show you guys because i just got the jacket back um when i purchased the jacket from zara it was in a, an XL but for some strange reason it was so big they didn't say anything about it being oversized so I was kind of confused so she did take it in a lot let me grab it for you guys um I am going to pop in a video with me with it on but here's the jacket it's so bright guys um, I hope you guys can see it but it's like a satin <clears throat> Now, I love light colors on my skin. I used to be a person who loved, I don't want to say bright colors, but I did like color. But I noticed the older that I get, neutral colors look really, really good on my skin tone. Um, and they say neutrals are for everyone, but I, I don't know if I believe that. But here's the jacket. Let me come a little closer for you guys. It's so bright because this, this light is on, but I am going to pop in. I'm gonna pop in a picture and then a video with me me with it on. So I'll pop in the video with how big it was on me <laughs> and then how it looks on me now. I didn't do anything to the sleeves this time. Um, and the reason why is because I thought they were like, okay. They're like hitting me right there. So I'm gonna pop in a video so you guys can see this um as to how much she's taking it in for me i'm telling you guys tailoring is your best friend let me zipper it up i mean button it up you guys can't see it but i am like i said i'm gonna pop in an actual video of you guys of me with it on but she did such an amazing job um and this is a long line blazer I'll style it up in another video. Actually, it looks cute with what I have on right now uh, because it's like uh, neutral colors. But I love it so much. And again, guys, I'm gonna I'm gonna move the camera down and I'm gonna move it back up. This is so not cool, but I'm gonna show you guys the whole thing. I don't have any shoes on. Let's see if I could. Let me see, guys. Just so you guys can see it. I'm gonna move the camera down some. Okay. Can you guys see? Yeah, this is good. Maybe I'll crop out that piece. <laughs> so this is the jacket. Um, let me open it back up so you guys can see it. It was large. I I'll show you. <laughs> I don't even know if you can really see it in the video because the video was, um, on my cell phone because I didn't think about showing you guys um, and the sleeves are hitting me like exact which I usually don't do but it's okay in this case because it's such a nice jacket um, so she brought it in to where now if I button it it's like this right I still have room I do have on a tank top under here so if I were to put like a shirt but let me tell you guys this thing was like out it was so it was so far out and i was like that's an extra large um but this is it this is the jacket yeah it's satin well satin like guys <laughs> it feels like satin um but i absolutely love it it actually looks cute with what i have on right now but i don't need a jacket outside and it's long in the back so that's why i like it too and it's with you know zara I don't know you gotta you gotta catch Zara with their really really nice blazers let's pull this back up 
so you guys can see my face. You gotta catch Zara with their things. Um, I believe I said this before about Zara's stuff. Um, if you want to make sure you're purchasing the best quality, Turkey, the stuff made in Turkey is really good. And the stuff in Morocco. Now, the stuff in Morocco usually is small. But in this case, it wasn't. So this was made in Morocco. Um, and it's just a really, really, really nice jacket. Okay? It's a really nice jacket. So this was just a quick little... And when I say quick, I just wanted to show you guys some of the things you can do if you are a tall person. You can size up and get it tailored, okay? Only reason why I got an extra large is because I noticed that it was made in Morocco. So I assumed <laughs> that from my past um, purchases from Zara that it was gonna be small. But this is probably an oversized jacket, which it did not say on um, online. So I guess it was. But let me just wrap it back up in here. But these are some of the things that you guys can do I guess one day I can show you guys all of my jackets that I that I have gotten tailored um, and like altered to fit my style. Because I'm telling you guys, it is no joke as a tall woman when you can't find things that are stylish, that are good quality um, in our sizes. And I have an online boutique, but it's kind of like at a pause now because I really, the stuff is nice. I try to pick the best quality from these vendors. However, I'm still very finicky about stuff. So I spend a lot of money on jackets when they fit me nice because I know that it's hard for us to find stuff. So for me, I don't mind spending an extra $600 because it's gonna fit my body. Now, if I was average height, in the story, <laughs> I can probably find a lot more things um, that are good quality, for a cheaper price um so that's kind of like the ugly side of being tall like you know having to spend more money shoes all those things so when it comes to shirts and stuff i'm pretty okay with shirts my arms are not like super long um but it's my legs so the pants that i actually have on i i probably pop in a picture um i did i just did a video and these are from express they, they're ankle pants, but these are true ankle pants for a tall woman. Why? Because they're like all the way down there. They're not like high up. I have some pants where I'm like, okay, these are not real ankle pants. <laughs> um, and I can tell, I don't know if other people can tell, but I know. So these are true ankle pants where they're like at the ankle, the proper, proper length. Um, those are just things that we struggle with guys. And for my tall ladies, if you have not found this channel yet, make sure you send this to any of your friends who struggle with shopping for their height. You guys know I am a personal stylist. I'm a style coach. So I teach women how to shop for their body and how to find things that actually fit for them, their color palette, things like that. Um, I see a lot of women wearing things that are trendy and I think they're wearing them because it's trendy, but it doesn't necessarily mean that it's the best look for them. Um, you know, to each his own, but I know how nice a woman can look with certain things. Um, and just a quick little tailoring, guys, will definitely help you in getting that perfect fit for your body type. Um, we're all made uniquely different, okay? Um, I'm tall, I'm bigger at the bus, I don't have no booty, okay? It is what it is. <laughs> So I have to do things to like accentuate my hips and things like that. Um, and here's the thing, I don't mind. Like I've just learned over the years how to shop for my body, how to style things for my body. That's why I'm really not really big on trends because all trends are not for everyone, guys. You might have to skip a couple out, skip them, and just wait for the next one. Or I always say this, there's always colors within that season that you could actually do to kind of feel like you're still you know down with the quote-unquote trends guys so if you like videos like this please comment below let me know I buy a lot of things guys and I don't share them and I'm starting to get in the groove of this again um showing you guys some of the things that I like to buy 
for me as a tall woman. I'm telling you, it is no freaking joke out here. And I think I've said this before. I feel like since I've been in Georgia, Atlanta, the struggle is real. I didn't have this problem in New York. I was able to like really maneuver. I had really great tailors up there. Um, I also don't really be outside like that either. So, <laughs> but <laughs> that could be it. But I just don't see it when I go shopping. It's not the same shopping experience. So I definitely do a lot of online shopping, which I highly recommend for my tall ladies because anybody actually, because sometimes we just don't have these things here in our local stores. So shopping online is the best option. So if you like videos like this, please comment below. And if you stay to the end of this video, please comment Coco We See You. And guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Coco Styles NY. That is my business page. And Coco Styles NYC. That is my page for tall women. You guys will see my name in the bio and all that good stuff. And head over to my blog, Coco Styles NYC. That is my personal blog and to my styling website for styling services for my corporate professional women. That is CocoStylesNY.com. Guys, you guys can book a complimentary style direction call and kind of get flowing with what you're trying to do with your style as far as your professional image and even your leisure time, guys. Um, it's something that I love to do. I love when I can take a woman from zero to 100 and they're totally happy and the best part that i love <laughs> is that when i teach them strategy and stuff they now know how to shop for their body don't overspend on things that they don't need invest in the proper pieces don't just buy everything that you see everybody else doing because you'll end up broke guys <laughs> so if you are new to this channel comment below too and subscribe guys it is more of this to come I'm getting back into the swing of things and you guys won't be disappointed. All right, guys. Bye.